Hey guys, and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption. When we last left off, we were off to meet our new friend, Excuse Nigel. Excuse me, sir, you need help? Mister, you alive? Fuck, fuck, God damn it. Good heavens. Excuse me? I said, no, I'm not okay. Do I look like I'm okay? You look pretty good for a corpse. <laughs> Praise be. Move up, mister. Time to get you to a doctor, or an undertaker. Whichever you need once we get to town. Uh, St. Peter, open up them pearly gates! I'm coming home! <laughs> Come on, mister. Come on. Hurry, sir. I'm bleeding like a badly butchered hog. You'll be fine. Just focus. So what the hell happened to Nigel? You better take the reins. I don't think I'm strong enough. <laughs> I'm finished. Done for. Just sit up straight, will you? <clears throat> Armadillo, friend. Yeah, he's um. He's a bit of a uh, drama queen, shall we say. You're, we're staying on the road. Who are these people? And why are they after you? That would be my question. Oh, a bit of a rough turning here, but that's fine. Yeah, he's a bit of a whiner and a complainer, but that's fine. Oh, easy there. Keep on the straight and narrow. Eh, uh, you're fine. We're not stopping. <laughs> so I'm guessing our man here has been shot or something. This is getting worse. Yeah, yeah, he's really starting to bleed out now. Oh God, we've actually lost the horse. Uh, yeah, that's not fantastic. <laughs> You're fine, dude. You're fine. Chill the fuck out, honestly. I can always wrangle you up another horse. If your money's good, anyway. Good God. This is it. You're going to make it. Oh. Where the devil are we? Armadillo. We made it safe. You'll be happy to know. Thank you, sir. Thank you. You're a gentleman and a, a true man of honor. Coming from you, I doubt that means much, but I appreciate the civility. I owe you, sir. And I always pay my debts. Uh, Jesus. But if I die, I'm sorry for it. If not, I'll be your man for, for. Let's get you fixed up first. Then we'll decide what you're my man for. <clears throat> Not much. Right. Well, that's Nigel patched up. Hey, duster coat. Let's have a little look at that, shall we? Uh, so deadly assassin where's the duster I actually quite like the duster ah there we go worn out duster the coat protects your clothing from trail dust but not much else yeah let's go swap into our duster alright so yeah Nigel he's a uh, snake oil salesman and a pretty lousy one uh, he has a 
questionable reputation. But uh, we're going to be finding out quite a lot more about him a little bit later on. Um, have I gone? I've gone. No, we can get. Out. They're out here. Out of the way, ladies. I want my duster coat. Right, let's go for. There we go. Ah, much better. The hell's going on out here? Yeah, sure. Accidental. Why not? Right now, <clears throat> the hell's going on here? Um, uh, not really sure what that was about, but whatever. Anyway, let's go see the marshal. See if the marshal's got anything else for us before we start dealing with good old Nigel Dickens. Ah, Nigel. Oh, there's a stranger here as well. A very upset stranger by the sounds of things. Spare the rod. <laughs> ah, since you're here, you want to make yourself useful? Not particularly. <laughs> Listen, son, I know you got a mission. But right now, I need another gun. Why? What's happening? We've had this problem for months with this group of bandits who were getting drunk and murdering uh -oh. Last night they went to a big place up near Ridgewood. They burnt the place down, killed the men, burning most of them alive, and raped the women. Women folk then got their throats slit. One of them survived and walked in here this morning. Anyway, we got a posse gathering up near Ridgewood. Will you ride with us? All right. Thank you, John Marston. It's gonna be a bloody job. Huh. I don't think I know any other. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that's pretty dark. Hey, wait up! <laughs> Better lay off the old booze, there, Chief. We need you shooting straight. Well, it ain't gonna be anything good, that's for sure. Ooh. Oh. Alright. My bad, my bad. Ain't no survivors here, Marshal. Man, this don't look too good. Somebody was so busy killing people, they went and dropped their gun. You've acquired a new weapon in the same category as the one you already have. Check the weapons tab on the pause menu. Yeah. Um. I think this weapon system is, like, way better. Than the system in the second game weapon system in the second game is just needlessly complex quite often you'll uh, go off and you'll forget that you've left all your weapons on your horse for instance it's just silly uh, so we have a much better repeater now excellent uh, oh yeah we might not, might need a horse probably don't want to stand in the fire either yeah something bad's going on down here that's okay. We're here to fix it. Wait, are you serious? But we didn't abandon. He just fucked off without us. Is basically what he did. 
Uh. All right, now this time, hopefully everybody ain't gonna get away. I think it always selects like the better weapon, which is cool. Right. Uh huh. Oh, that's a coyote. We need to kill X amount of those. Yeah, annoyingly. Who could have done such a thing? Any number of people. Especially now the word's out we're swinging up uh, the county. Between wolves, the boys, and the rustlers, we've been spilling a lot of blood. Man gets more evil when he's running scared. Poor vultures. This don't look so good. God damn it. Come on. Let's Just like murdering on. everybody. That's definitely uh, a group of people that we need to be murdering. Just literally going from group to group, just murdering everybody. Ah, things are pretty unhinged around here. Alright. Some men gotta die. This is too quiet. I got a bad feeling about this. Split up and search the area. John, you check the buildings in the barn. Okay. <sighs> Let's go have a little look, see what we can't find. Nobody's in the shed. Nope, no one in the shed. There's no goodies in the shed either. Unfortunately. Don't mind me, officer. <laughs> I like the way um, John actually. What the fuck was that? That was some quick stepping. Actually uh, changes what he says depending on the context and who's bumping into. That's cool. Also, when I retried this level to get us back up to where we were, uh, we got completely different dialogue, which was cool. No well, looks like everyone's in the barn. This should be some good shooting. Let's get the horse over here. There's no good reason for that to be boarded up. Not really. Shoot that door open. Oh. That's not good. Mother of mercy. Please, please don't shoot me. The bandits came by and took us hostage. They're holed up in the farmhouse. Some of my family is being kept hostage inside. <laughs> That's bad. Bloody hell. All right. Let's kill everyone. Wow. Bandits, anyway. Right, evasive maneuvers. There's a few of them. All right, guys, laws here. And there's going to be absolutely low mercy. Ooh. They all want to die. That's why they're here. Keep them coming. Ho, ho, ho. Don't worry, we're going to be searching up all of these guys. Certainly need to get some uh, payback for what's happened around here. Because that ain't right. No, sir. I think there's, yeah, a person above us. It ain't going to end well for them, John. Oh, hello. Oh, good 
fucking night, son. Alright, uh, everybody. Oh, hello. Say, so everybody be cool. <clears throat> You're making a big mistake, friend. Yeah, no shit. Right, get up, John. Let's go. There's going to be a lot of bodies in this place by the time we're finished. You and me gonna have ourselves we are. Fucking sleeping at the wheel, mate. Go home, buddy. There's no good, is it? What have we got, here? got some more bullets. Sleeping at the wheel. Imagine that. Alright, boss. Let's see the best way to handle this. Oh, she's not dead. Whew. Jump for joy. I'm pretty sure he blew the back of her, uh, her head off. I'm not sure how we survived. Or she survived, I should say. But, you know, I'm glad she did. Because there's already enough people dead around here. There we go. Another six bucks. Six bucks is six bucks. Whew. Now there's certainly a rabid band of scum that needed to be put down. Not quite a happy ending. Well, I appreciate the uh, what she's saying, but you can only do so much. Especially in this lawless country where anybody can get a gun and anybody can go spazzy. Certainly sounds that way. Wait, who's that up there? You just walk away now, John. I didn't kill you before, but I sure as shit will now. Get yourself down here, Bill. You know you ain't man enough to stop me. <laughs> you know I don't want to kill you, but I will. You always did have a high opinion of yourself, John. <laughs> Dutch always said you were an arrogant son of a bitch. I guess he was about right. Get him, boys! So it is. It's Bill's doing. Everybody, take cover! In that shed! Right, well, this is getting pretty rough. Alright. Let's do this. Pretty sure we're not going to be getting billed just yet. We'll be killing them. Don't worry about that. We've already cut most of them down. Ooh, look at this. Bit of atmosphere. 
<laughs> God damn rapists! To be fair, this is the best thing to do to them. This is what we should be doing these days. Who's next? Instead of, you know, paying to have them sent to jail. If you can't be part of society, you shouldn't be part of it. Right. Things are looking pretty hectic here. Alright. That horse actually took one for his the team there. Bless him. Come on, let's see that little head of yours. There you go. Yep. And they're going to be paying for their sins right now. Whoa. Looks like Bill's got a lot of men. More than Dutch had. Let's see that head. Alright, we're not the most accurate shot in the world. Dude, there's just one of you left. Ooh, right through the head. Shoot him in the back. <laughs> Look what I got here. This something makes you still breathing. Come here, boy. <laughs> <laughs> gonna help us get the bill ain't you norman thank you mr dick mighty kind fuck you hog time let's get him oh he gonna hang right well before we get out of it i'm gonna start harvesting up all these bodies not bad we made ourselves a somewhat decent amount of coin anyway Let's head back. Let's carry on doing some missions for the marshal. That was pretty ugly. Oh! Help a lady! What were these two? All these guys out here? You think must think I was born yesterday? Right, what are we looking at? That was close. That was way too close. Good God. Apparently there's still one here. Uh-huh. Get off the bloody wagon, John. I'm not gonna kill you. All right, get out of here. Oh, I can hear a coyote. I can hear a coyote. Where are you? You little bastard. Right, loot body. That's not bad. We just made nearly like a hundred, nearly a hundred freaking dollars from looting all those bodies. I'm happy with that. Okay. Let's go back to the marshal. Oh. I guess we've done all the missions now. Well, we've got a stranger here. Ah, oh, the new American appetites. Let's go do that and then we'll call it a mission. Uh, call it a mission? Call it a day. Alright, cold midnight. Let's fly. Do like the way the storm rolled in as uh, the action was getting pretty heavy there. Nice bit of atmosphere. A dark end to a very dark mission. Well, there's going to be no peace around these parts whilst Bill's still doing his thing. So we're going to endeavour to do our best to put an end to him. Right. Now before we do anything too crazy let's go save the game I thought there was a quick way up 
Yeah. Yeah, there is. I say a quick way up. It's not exactly that quick. But I suppose it is quicker. Can we not? There we go. Let's go sleep off this storm. Wonderbar. Well, we put a lot of bad men down. Let's go see if we can find another one in the hills. All right, cold midnight. Let's ride. So, hey, eh? you want to go as well, son? Oh, it's you. Really? Agree to a duel, sure. Alright, your funeral. Or possibly mine. Hopefully his. See if we can put this piece of shit in the ground. See if I can remember how to duel. Memory is uh, <laughs> less than fantastic. Right, there we go. Pull it right up and then. E nope. Come on. Why can't we shoot? Why can't we shoot? Yeah. God damn it. That happened to us before. It wouldn't allow us to add any. I think what it is is because we've gone off the, the target. I know how we do this now. I just hope he's there again. Because, um. We actually, when we got killed by the last jeweler, twice. Uh, in Thieves Landing, he actually disappeared. Hopefully, he's still there. This goddamn storm is still going. Alright. Let's see if we can't... Is he there again? Is that him? I think that was him. Might have to wait for him to get into position again. Maybe? In his own sw Oh! Hello, Herbert Moon! I see him. No worries, Mr. Moon. This happens a lot, by the way. Alright. <sighs> Well, that wasn't too smart now, fella. Oh, what the hell? Hogtie? That was almost iffy. Almost. Should have just shot him in the leg. Son of a bitch. Alright, Mr. Her Herman Moon. Or Hermit Moon. Let's take this delivery of shit back to our friend. Yeah, I believe this was like one of the earliest memes. Is uh, Mr. Moon always freaking out about being robbed. He gets robbed pretty much like every day. Don't know why they still bother. I guess there's like X amount of random events that can possibly happen in each town. <laughs> I love the way he just kicks in. <laughs> hey, we got 27 bucks as well. Not bad. Alright. Let's go see this stranger. Hey, we got a little bit more fame as well. And apparently we're very honourable. Hello. Up in the hills? 
How did you know, mister? You should guess. If I find him, I'll bring him back to you. But people seem to go missing up there. <laughs> oh, my God. If he's gone, then what'll I do? We ain't got much money. Tell me the family where he can. As I said, I'll do what I can. Damn. That's not great. So she's up the duff. Let's go see if we can't sort out the hills. Come on, midnight. We got an ugly bit of business to do. Okay. Let's get back up to the hills. Yeah, the actual map system in this game is, uh, or the waypoint system, I should say, really ain't that great. Only follows the roads, which I think it kind of did in the early GTA games as well. But in the early GTA games, the roads kind of went everywhere. Not so much here. Alright. Let's go see what we can't find. Here we are. Careful now, midnight. Don't go breaking your Ooh, hello. Been attacked. City fella just attacked me and broke Ooh. my leg. What? He broke my leg. Some city fella. The guy got kind of creepy on me. And then he got violent. When? Just now. Uh, he ran off that way. Can't have gone too far. If I find him, I'll bring him back this way. Thank you, mister. <laughs> hmm. Catch the assailant and bring him back. Yeah. What's wrong with you? I'm not liking the vibes of this, I'll be honest. Leave you. Why won't you people just leave me alone? Leave you alone? Don't take me back to that man. Why is that? That man definitely, definitely looked, uh, Please. all there. Come on, buddy. Let's go see your friend. We can work all of this out. Don't you worry about it. I'm sure this man is a perfectly normal mountain dweller. What could possibly be the problem? And why did you break his leg? Let's go see our friend here. There you go. Now, what are you going to do with this fella? Oh, my good lord. Please get that man away from me. Uh, uh. Hey, fella. <laughs> you broke this uh, poor fool's uh, leg, mister. Uh, this maniac tried to eat me. We've got cannibals in these here hills. Please help me. What? Please. Fella's got to eat now. Fella's got to eat. Ah. Uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> please. Please. <laughs> Decide whether to save the man or let the cannibal eat him. Well... We don't have cannibals around here. That guy's... That guy has caused way too much grief. <sighs> Alright, friend. Let's get you up. So let's hope that that was the uh, only cannibal up in these hills. Not sure why you can... Uh, let the cannibal live I mean it's I don't get me wrong it's cool to have the choice but I can't see why <laughs> um, that's a lot of pain and misery that you're kind of unleashing on this place but you know I suppose that's kind of some people's thing but I believe that is oh uh, we've got fever for you we've got fever for you oh rabbit nope we don't need any more rabbits but we do need coyotes 
I saw that coyote. There he is. There he is. He's trying to get away. Not today, friend. Now, do we actually have to catch and skin coyotes? Uh, oh. Kill five coyotes before any coyote damages you. Uh, well, I mean, we are actually making progress with that. So I don't think that one's going to be too hard to do. Right. And we need to collect the pelt. So what I'm going to do here, guys, I'm going to end the video. Uh, and when we come back, well, I guess we're going to go see what old Nigel West Dickens has for us. Right, skin animal. So thanks for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.